Welcome in, everyone. <laughs> Spit Cup is joining us. What happened to you, Spit oh. Cup? Oh, man. Uh, Gary, man, I'm trying to make it up there, man, but I, you know, yesterday when I came out of that red town to, to count deer. Yeah. Well, I, I flipped my truck, Gary, man, and I'm... And I'm flipped your truck? <clears throat> yeah, and guess where I'm at? Where? I'm still in my truck. Well... I'm, I'm uh, sad. Well, at least through te telephone technology, you're with us this morning. Uh, yeah, and I finally got through to somebody. I've been trying to call, you know, my my buddy Hot Tub Tony. I can't get a hold of him, and uh, well, I'm just still out here counting deer. Yeah, and, man. And I tell you what, my truck's messed up like a redneck's dental history. Well, that's pretty bad. I hope everything's going to be all right now. Uh, I don't know, Gary. I'm still my. I'm actually upside down right now. I get a hold of your mother-in-law. She's like a human wrecker. She pull you right out of whatever you're in. Yeah, I was having flashbacks of them whisker burns in here, man, and I'm still upside down, Gary. I'm, I mean, I'm getting lightheaded. Yeah. And uh, I can't get out of here, man. Well, we got to do something about that. I don't want you to spend another night in Slocum Memorial after mm -hmm. you. You like your mother-in-law hugged you so hard. She was so happy about winning the post hole digging Olympics. You remember she hugged you, and then you had them third degree whisker burns. And uh, oh, you've yeah, been lightheaded uh, ever since. Yeah, I remember that, Gary. Yeah, and, yeah. Y'all not remind me of it. Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> what can you tell us about what's going well, on? Uh, well, there's a whole bunch of deer down here. I've been counting, and you know, it's kind of. Uh, have you ever tried to write? A uh, letter or note or anything upside down? No, I'm, I don't think I've ever done that. Uh, you wouldn't figure it'd be any trouble, but it is, man. I'm counting deer and I'm logging it down on my deer log here, and, yeah. and I'm upside down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to, I tell you what, Gary, if you can call some people and get some help for me down here and get me out of here, and then I might try to come up there and see you or something, man. I, uh, and I guess I can, uh, I got my redneck stock report ready for you tomorrow. And, yeah, yeah. Uh, but if you can call and get me some help, I sure appreciate it. Now, man. Well, we'll sure do it. Uh, and uh, like I say, we'll do whatever it takes. You know, uh, your mother-in-law, she she can really come in handy in situations like this. Nobody can bend metal like she can. Well, uh, so. well, I ain't got a flat tire, Gary. Yeah. I don't know if she'd help me or not. She, If I had a flat tire, she'd be all over it, but... I got a, um, I tell you what, Gary, my truck's, I don't know if she can bend it or not. I, my truck's messed up like the heel on a redneck house shoe. Well, that's a pretty bad deal there. We got to get somebody down there. Now, anything else you want to talk about or? Oh, uh, no, Gary. I, the only thing I'm trying to talk about right now is getting out of here. Oh. And, and I'm just counting deer to pass the time. All right. And how many you counted so far? I got 117 of them right now. Wow. That's impressive. But, uh, oh, my God. What? I don't know what that was. Something trying to get in my window here. Uh-oh. Well, I better uh, get somebody down there. I hope it ain't one of them humpback mountain after there. Oh, man, what is that? Well, that's not good, uh, Spit Cup. <laughs> well, Spit Cup, we will get somebody down there, and hopefully you'll be ready to go when the Redneck Stock Report comes up. All uh, right? Yeah, yeah. I think. Thanks, Gary. All right. We well, your Spit Cup's a little bit of trouble, folks. As soon as I get out of here, I'm going to handle up. All right, well, let's all handle up here on Kick 98.3 with Spit Cup.